ki khubor ka batisi tv lawan ra shapi da ka orange nissan loom so po near fire brigade shillong admissions are open at bdw international school enroll now ka kinhon mentri jong ka sarkar jilla ha ka khat khandai tri ko banai ka lal lingkot ar hazar ar pu ar kala menjur ban penjlan ye karta wat kam ha kitna tri kam ka sarkar jilla na ka ar pu hu nyos nem sha ka lai pu ar snem kar bai ki reu lom schedule tribe la penjlan sho sho da san snem kata ha du lai pu hu nyos nem karta Menteri Rangba Jongka Jelau Konrad Kongkal Sangma haka jingya keren bat kilal pathai khubor hadin melawai ke jingya lang jongka kinhon menteri ulia thoru ba yakani ke jing penjelan Yakarta wat kam anam pentrai kam satya haka jing penrung kam ha katanat pulit ha katanat home guard and civil defense ha katanat forest guard bad hikikat to kat ni ki post jongka tanat presence The government has decided also to have age relaxation for entry into government service from the age of 27 to 32 this will not include an exemption has been given for police home police so any recruitment done by home police will be exempted from this decision forest guards will be exempted from this decision the home guards and civil defense will also be exempted and also the prisons officials the uh, sorry the prisons uh, department also certain posts will also be exempted from this so the point is the uniformed posts that are there which require a uh, slightly more physical work will uh, have uh, the same age limit as before and there will be no change in that but for all other government services the age relaxation has been increased from 27 to 32 uh, and for the st uh, another 5 years will be added so that's 37 uh, yes they may some of may, may feel that but this has been done after due consultation with the departments we have consulted the forest the home erts and all the other departments where the uniformed uh, personnel are there and uh, it is a matter of fact that uh, there needs to be some kind of a physical strength and therefore obviously as one gets older then the physical strength uh, gets lesser so therefore keeping the interest of the forces in mind and the ultimate service that they have to do to the people the departments felt that uh, they should be exempted from this age limit and accordingly they said yes there could be plus and minus but uh, there is more plus to the overall service to the people and the state and the departments by ensuring that the age limit is not increased in this um, i mean the uniform service Hagajo Kapoor Menteri Rangba ula pentip ru ba ka kinhon menteri kala menjur ru ban thau ye ka village health council ha ka jilla ha ka baki rangba shnong kinokma kinong trei jong katanat ka kot ka khia kin long kit khot hapo kani ka council The state government today has also the cabinet has also approved the <coughs> policy for village health councils of Meghalaya and this is being done with the objective of focusing on the health sector at the village level so village health councils will be created along with uh, of course the coordination and cooperation of the headmen's the rambashnongs nokmas uh, and this village health council will focus mainly on important uh, health issues that are there at the village level and it will be a first point contact for at least the basic health services and uh, other health related issues at the village level comprise of male and female heads of households of every household in the village the vhcs will be headed by the headman as the chairperson so headman means rangbashnong or nokpa or the headman as a chairperson and the president of the village organization will be the co chair the vhc will also have an executive committee whose members will be democratically elected and the committee will comprise of minimum 10 members the secretary of the vhc will be an elected person uh in every alternative election only women candidates would be eligible for this position 50% of the membership of the uh of the council of the of the ec that is executive committee of the vhc will be reserved for women the executive committee of the village health council shall meet once every fortnight and the ashas and the awws are to be members and the anm as honorary member 
the village health council will subs will subsume the village health and sanitation committee taking over the duties of the village health and sanitation committees <laughs>